Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, to the volley, just hi, with Shono here, about to give you another Diablo 4 video. In this video, I want to show off some Diablo 4 gameplay with the RTX 4090 laptop GPU, also known as the XG Mobile, for the ROG Ally. And you can see in the top left corner all the stats that come from the ROG Ally's FPS counter. So right now, we're having no resolution scaling, frame generation is completely off, and we have... Everything's set to low settings except for I turn low FX off And we're gonna see what type of frame rates we get all tests will be done at 1080p because there's no reason to go below I tried to do 4k resolution in the past and that did not work very well So what we're gonna do is we're gonna head to a nightmare dungeon. Let's head to a tier 21 And let's get started with some FPS testing. So we're gonna be testing combat for about two minutes in six different profiles. We're gonna start with the low, medium, high, ultra, actually eight profiles. And then we're gonna do low, medium, high with frame generation and everything else turned on. So you see everything looks crystal clear right now. We're at 148 FPS with everything basically off. So we're going to go to about 605, then we're going to switch resolutions. I am on hardcore, so I do have to make sure I do not get in combat with anything when I switch over. And I've been loving Barb. I can't wait to make my Barb a moral somehow. We get that necklace from Duriel and some other random uniques all right so you can see the fps going pretty well obviously low settings nothing to be worried about First real test complete. Now we're going to change the resolution. Okay, so now we're at medium settings. We still have frame generation and resolution scaling disabled. We'll turn on DLSS later. And you see not a lot of difference between medium and low. Still getting way over 120 FPS, which is more than the ROG Ally can handle, as it should be with a 4090. But here's the thing, if you don't mind playing at 720p low, you definitely don't need an XG Mobile for this. I made a couple other videos on Diablo 4, including a Steam Deck comparison in the past, so if you need another recommendation, check that video out at the end of the video. So barely under 120 FPS, we are getting over it. Still very solid gameplay though. Anything over 60, I think it's solid gameplay. My personal opinion. You don't need 120 FPS to have a good time. It is recommended to have at least 60. You definitely don't want 30 FPS playing Diablo 4. You can't hit 60, tone your graphics down. Yeah, everything running buttery smooth, 130 FPS. So that's a test on medium settings. Let's go to high now. All right, now we are on high settings with resolution scaling default and frame generation turned off. Still looks like a beautiful game. You can see even at high settings, the frame rate isn't affected that much. We have a couple of dips in the low 110, but nothing like really ridiculously low. Still about 130. Still pushing 130, 140, so it doesn't seem to be much difference between low and high settings doing this. 
which is pretty crazy. A little bit of shadow damage there, but nothing overwhelming. <clears throat> so yeah, it looks like the lowest we got was about 110 FPS. Pretty good. Let's get ready to change the resolution setting again. Over to Ultra and see if we notice any difference. Okay, now we're on Ultra settings. And still doesn't seem to be much difference with a 4090. Still hovering between 110 and... They were saw 103. Not that much difference in frame rate, though. Definitely don't need to turn DLSS and frame generator on if you don't need to. Obviously, more frames are always good. Not a requirement. So, yeah, it looks to be low 100s in combat. 130s. But not doing a whole lot. Once again, we're using the XG Mobile 4090 for the ROG Ally. If you guys like this gameplay video, give me some ideas on what other games you'd like to see tested on this ROG Ally. I'm, not ready yet. I'm a huge fan of Diablo 4, so I definitely had to do this game. Now let's turn on the frame generation and see what happens. Okay, so we're still on ultra settings, and now we turned on both the LSS and frame generation. And you can see our frame rates are well over 160 now. Dips into the 130s, 140s, hovering around 150 average. So about 130 to 160. Let's get into some combat and see what happens. You can definitely tell a noticeable boost in frame rate and no real difference in performance. Graphics. All right, so I got to dip to 127, 125. Nothing too overwhelming. Right? Definitely nothing the game can't handle. And this is on ultra settings. what that was, that little stuttering there. Alright, so we're going to put it at low settings, and that'll be the final test. We are going to keep frame generation and DLSS on, but you have an idea what frame rates you're getting. Okay, so now we got the settings on low. For some reason, it was under 120 there. So it looks like changing the resolution setting doesn't really do much when you have a 4090. It's almost like ultra... You notice a few frame differences, but nothing major. Like, we've seen 160 at low. I haven't seen it really go under 140 now that we're in combat and APU is back up to 30 watts. And that is the ROG Ally with an RTX 4090. Very impressive performance and definitely no issues running the game, even max out. If there's a setting that you wish I would have tested, let me know. I can make a follow-up video. But yeah, we've had no issues with this. DL DLAA is the highest quality. And... There's an ultra performance. And recommended for 8K gameplay only. Yeah, definitely want the highest image quality for sure. And yeah, pretty cool stuff. Put everything back up to Ultra. 
And yeah, you can see that the ROG hand ally handles this like a champ. No issues whatsoever. And when the FPS goes to NA, that's when it's changing the resolutions. 1% low of 45 there, but yeah. Really good frame rates and really good resolution. So if you like this little ROG ally testing the 4090 XG Mobile on Diablo 4, please give this video a like rating, comment, subscribe. Share this video amongst your friends and as a favorite. Check out my other ROG Ally videos, my playlist, Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch, which are all Hollywood Show. My Instagram, which is Hollywood Show Knows God. And if you want to see more games tested on the ROG Ally, leave a comment down below. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day, kids. Be sure to visit my Facebook group, Hollywood Show No Gaming, for the latest gaming needs. Also, check out my Twitch at Hollywood Shono and my Hollywood Shono YouTube live streams for all premieres of past live streams on Twitch. www.youtube.com slash Hollywood Shono. Subscribe, bitches! I'm better than you, and you know it.